Welcome to a showdown like no other in the captivating realm of virtual reality. Get ready to embark on a journey that will not only help you decide between the Meta Quest 2 and the all-new Meta Quest 3, but will also unveil the most thrilling and immersive VR games that will leave you spellbound. In this video, we're not just comparing specs, we're igniting a fierce battle between these VR powerhouses by pitting them against each other in the arena of the top games. It's a clash of titans that will determine the ultimate gaming experience. But that's not all, as a special treat, we have something extraordinary in store that will keep you glued to your screen until the very end. Are you ready to discover the future of VR gaming and choose the perfect headset for your adventures? Let's dive right in and explore the thrilling world of Meta Quest 2 vs Quest 3. Design Introducing the Meta Quest 3, a headset that may seem similar to the Quest 2 at first glance, but packs some game-changing upgrades. This sleeker and slimmer device, boasting a 40% reduction in size compared to its predecessor, owes its trim profile in part to the innovative pancake optics, enabling higher res lenses in tighter spaces through optical layering. But that's not all. The Quest 3 now features an all-new front-facing camera setup, complete with dual 4 MP RGB color cameras and a depth sensor in between. This not only provides a more precise view of your surroundings, but also offers vibrant full-color video pass-through. Beyond these enhancements, there are a few thoughtful tweaks. The top strap now takes a V-shaped approach for a more secure fit, and adjusting your IPD, interpupillary distance, is a breeze with the handy new wheel, eliminating the need for lens fiddling and spacer hassle. Lastly, the Quest 3 seems to redirect its speakers to optimize sound quality, promising potential improvements over the already impressive Quest 2 audio. Hey Levitators, are you tired of the MetaQuest 2 limiting your gameplay due to its short battery life? Well, check out the Q2 head strap by Anna Pro. It's soft and comfortable and has breathable material that makes it easier for you to play games for an extended period of time. But the main thing that it offers is that it 2Xs your battery life thanks to the rechargeable battery built into the headset. It also has five adjustable points to reduce pressure around your face for those long playing sessions. Check out the Q2 head strap by Anna Pro below and let me know what you think in the comments. Exciting times ahead for VR enthusiasts. Displays. When we talk about the Quest 2 display, it's decent, but the competition has moved ahead. Its resolution of 1832x1920 per eye is a step behind the PSVR 2, which flaunts twin 4K OLED displays at 2000x2040. However, it's right in line with the Meta Quest Pro, sharing the same 1832x1920 per eye display resolution. Now, let's delve into the exciting realm of the Meta Quest 3's display, even though details are a bit elusive at the moment. The big picture is slowly coming into focus. Meta initially dropped a tantalizing hint, stating, Quest 3 combines our highest resolution display yet in pancake optics to make sure content looks better than ever. But here's the real scoop. The Quest 3 has made an appearance on Best Buy's website, revealing more about its resolution. Brace yourself for this. The Quest 3 will feature an LCD display, or maybe two, with a whopping nearly 30% leap in resolution from Quest 2. Our expectations are pointing toward an official display resolution of 4128 x 2208 pixels. That's 2064 x 2208 pixels per eye. Mind-blowing, right? Controllers. Say goodbye to the iconic tracking ring of the Quest 2 controller, as the Quest 3 introduces the Sleeker Touch Plus controllers. They draw inspiration from the Quest Pro's Touch Pro controllers, although they do miss out on the Pro controller's cameras. This raises a slight concern regarding potential tracking issues. However, there's a silver lining. The Quest 3 will support hand tracking right from the start. So outside of gaming, you might find yourself using controllers less often. Interestingly, it seems the Quest 3 will continue the Quest 2 controller's reliance on disposable batteries. The product listing at Best Buy confirms that the Quest 3 will come with two AA batteries, presumably one for each controller. But wait, there's more! One standout feature not held back for MetaConnect is TrueTouch haptics. These Touch Plus controllers in the Quest 3 will incorporate haptic feedback, 
borrowing a popular feature from the Touch Pro controllers. Performance When it comes to performance, Meta has been somewhat tight-lipped, leaving us eager for more details. However, what they have revealed so far is pretty exciting. In their official announcement, Meta proudly dubbed the Quest 3 as our most potent headset to date. This remarkable device will be powered by a cutting-edge Qualcomm Snapdragon SoC chipset, the exact name of which remains a tantalizing secret. What we do know is that Meta promises this new chipset will deliver over double the graphical prowess compared to the previous generation Snapdragon TPU in the Quest 2. We'll have to wait for further specifics, but Meta has hinted that more juicy tidbits will be unveiled later this year. This could potentially be a refined version of the Qualcomm Snapdragon XR 2 Plus featured in the Meta Quest Pro, or it might introduce an entirely new chipset. Regardless, what's crystal clear is that it's a step up from the Qualcomm Snapdragon XR2 used in the Quest 2. Games Here's some fantastic news if you're eyeing the Quest 3. It's fully compatible with the entire library of Quest 2 games. That means you'll have access to a vast selection of over 500 Quest 2 games right from the get-go, including the exciting titles announced at the MetaQuest Gaming Showcase 2023. At the moment, there haven't been any announcements regarding games exclusive to the Quest 3 that won't work on the Quest 2, but it's something we might see in the future. With the Quest 3's upgraded processor and intriguing mixed reality features, it's quite likely that developers will eventually leverage its advantages. But don't fret if you're a Quest 2 owner. Meta isn't abandoning it just yet. They see it as the entry point into the Meta VR ecosystem and have plans for an upcoming software update. This update is set to deliver a remarkable 26% boost in CPU performance and a GPU speed increase of up to 19% for the Quest 2. Additionally, it will introduce dynamic resolution scaling, enhancing frame stability with the increased pixel density. Mixed reality features, the Quest 2, at its core, is a VR headset, offering a fantastic virtual experience. While it does offer a limited black and white video pass-through, it's mainly there to help the headset understand your surroundings, like a virtual GPS for your room. Now, let's switch gears to the Quest 3, which is gearing up to blow our minds. It's all about full-color video pass-through with its advanced camera setup and depth sensor. These bad boys not only recreate your physical space accurately, but also pack 10 times the pixel power of the Quest 2's black and white cameras. Meta, the brain behind these headsets, has tantalizing plans for mixed reality. While they haven't spilled all the beans yet, they did give us a sneak peek in their announcement video. Imagine this, a Quest 3 user playing the VR game Dinio, but instead of a virtual tabletop, they're battling it out right on their real-life table. Mind-blowing, right? Price and availability. Now, let's talk dollars and accessibility, a big deal for many of us. The Quest 2's 128GB model currently sits at $399, with the 256GB model at $429. But hold on to your hats, because Meta just dropped a bombshell. Starting June 4, you can snag the Quest 2 for a jaw-dropping $299.99 for the 128GB version and $349.99 for the 256GB version. That's a whopping $200 cheaper than the Quest 3's 128GB model. There's word of a Quest 3 with more storage in the pipeline, but the details are still under wraps. If price is the name of your game, Quest 2 might be your knight in shining armor, available now in both storage sizes. But if you're itching for the Quest 3, you'll have to keep your eyes peeled for updates on the Quest 3 product page. It's not up for pre-order just yet, and its grand debut is set for Meta Connect on September 27. Which is best for you? The good news, Meta plans to keep the Quest 2 in its VR headset lineup. With that enticing price drop to $299 and continuous software enhancements, investing in a Quest 2 today won't leave you feeling like you wasted a dime. It might step aside eventually for the Quest 3, but that day seems distant. However, if you crave an adventure that seamlessly blurs the line between virtual and real worlds within one sleek headset, the Quest 3 seems like a no-brainer. Sure, its initial $499 price tag might raise eyebrows, 
But picture this, as developers craft games and apps, harnessing the Quest 3's mixed reality superpowers, it could very well become the ultimate VR headset for the masses. Exciting times are on the horizon. So, are you Team Quest 2 for the unbeatable price? Or are you ready to embrace the future with the Quest 3's mixed reality charm? Which headset and game combo has stolen your heart? Let us know in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our gaming adventures.